Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and this is the Jewel Ring puzzle. As you can uh, hear from its name and also see from its colors, it's two puzzle rings that have been woven together. So if you uh, look at uh, uh, what it looks like, well, it's a puzzle ring. And you see here two sets of colors, red and green, going through each other. So here you see the weave pattern from above. You can see the hole. You can see the ring parts. You can see a bit at the inside. And the way that this puzzle works is that I'm actually having three layers of uh, uh, puzzle rings. Usually in puzzle rings you have only two layers, but here I added a third layer. And this uh, construction as a whole, it's quite strong. It uh, just doesn't fall apart when you drop the ring. Unlike regular puzzle rings that fall apart, this one stays together. So it's a together strong puzzle. However, you can easily split it in two. And now you have two individual puzzle rings and each of them uh, functions like a puzzle ring. So I'm going to uh, take, uh, take apart the green one. And you see, it's just a classic uh, four band ring design. You open it and it's quickly scrambled. And the good news is that we have the other ring as example, so we know exactly how to make it. The two halves are identical uh, except for the color. So one uh, obvious application for this ring, where it's together strong, is that you sh could share it uh, uh, between two persons. So one person wears the red one and the other one wears the green one. And that's what my question is about. Uh, so if you have this dual ring and you share it between two persons, then what is the fundamental uh, problem with this ring design? Thank you for watching.